what's up you guys dude we're back again on the bench and we've got the drag car with us um dude rare tires we're gonna talk rare tires um i started off this whole adventure and uh the first set that i purchased were these hoosiers um these were pretty cool i seen everyone you know getting them their first tires so i got them um, when I ran the stock Valineon system, they were great. I noticed when I put them on here with the R1 system in there, they really ballooned up really big. Um, so I figured I would try something else. So I went with the reaction tires, and these are great. I'm running no foams in them at all. And um, I put them on the Proline uh, Split 6 wheels. Now, uh, this is a beadlock wheel, and uh, these come with these red rings here, but they are pretty heavy, you know. So, these are 3D printed, um, scaled by Chris. Uh, you can find these and get them from him, and they are pretty cool, man. I have a other set, um, which is all 12 bolts in it. Um, yeah, these are pretty nice. And then I wanted to try the DE Racing tires. Uh, these are the uh, Street Outlaw tires. They are the 1.7, 2.5 rear, the clay compound. That's what these were, the clay compound. And um, yeah, I wanted to try these out and see how they were going to do on the car. Um, you also need the rims, and there they are. So we are going to get these put on. And I'm going to weigh all these. I've got a scale right here that I will weigh all these and show you, you know, the difference in weight. Um, yeah, I weighed these things and they were pretty heavy compared to the uh, 3D printed ones. But, um, yeah, not bad at all, man. So I'm going to go ahead and get these out and then we'll go ahead and start weighing them up and see what they are. All right, guys. So... We've got the wheels um, out of the bag here, the tires and wheels. I'm looking pretty good. Very sticky, unreal. Um, I did also get another set of the rings. Um, these are the six holes and these are the 12 holes that go on there. Uh, and here are the metal ones. So basically I've got my scale on the table here. Um, let's go ahead and turn this on. Get this on there, a little tray. Okay, and we'll zero it out. Okay, so first thing I want to weigh and show you guys on these uh, split six beadlock wheels um, are the rings. Here's what the stock ring is going to weigh, and that is 16.7 grams right there, just on one ring 16.7 grams okay and now one of the um 3d printed rings so 3.9 grams so 3.9 you know compared to 16.6 so 16 and a half grams that is not bad at all not bad at all So there it is. So now when we weigh a tire, these Hoosiers, they have the foams in them. You know, they're on the, um, the Proline wheels. So let's weigh this and see how much these weigh in it. Right, so there they are at 114. Right there, 114 on the Hoosiers. Now, <clears throat> this is the reaction. No foams in here on the beadlock wheels with some 3D printed um, rings. And those are 122. So these were 114 and these are 122. So that's not that bad, not that bad. They're not that much heavier, you know? So these are a three piece wheel, you know, from the inside the ring and everything. So then we get to our DE wheel here, you know, and I'm going to get these, just push them in here, get them on. 
and then we'll weigh one of these and see what they're weighing in at. Alright, so these will come back apart definitely and get washed up and all that before they get glued. But again, I want to say something. These fit really nice on the rim. I said this before the last time when I did these uh, Proline tires. Um, <clears throat> when you use the Proline rim or the wheel and the tires together, dude, they fit amazing. Amazing. You know, just like these right here, the DE wheels with the tires. I mean, the fitment is absolutely amazing. I love it. It's perfect, you know. So there's one of them right here. Well, what I noticed before I weigh this was I did get a set of J Concept wheels. Um, I believe these are some stock ones. J Concepts are right here. So these are some stock BR10 wheels here. And um, these are the coil. From J Concepts. Uh, you could see how much wider they are. These stock Proline uh, wheels are this exact width right here and you can see the difference right there on them. So I ended up getting these wheels and I try to put these reaction tires on there and it just kept popping off. It, just, it would not fit the wheel right. It just would not fit it right. So that's why I'm not using these right here. You know, maybe if I get a set of J Concept tires, they'll fit these wheels a lot better right here. And this is a good looking wheel, but <clears throat> yeah, not gonna fit it. So, um, you know, when you run the, the wheel and tire from the same company, I think they fit a lot better. All right, let's weigh this thing and let's see what this thing's weighing in at. Alright, there it is. And this is at 112 right there. So these are 112 grams. These are 114 and these were 122. So there's the weight difference between all these three right here. And uh, yeah, we are definitely going to use them. Uh, I definitely like the beadlock, no gluing. And you can change out your tires and you know whatever i do not like the rings on them how heavy they are you know that is just ridiculous but and you got to remember dude you're you're you know your whole rotating mesh you you weigh it down you know you're just losing power right there eating up the power with all the weight so you know the and these are sticky as ever so um these are going to be my next time out i will try these out and see how they do and yeah, we'll go from there. And I'll definitely give you some feedback on these. But I'm going to go ahead and get these washed up, get them glued up. And um, yeah, we'll be ready to go, man. This thing will have some some tires on there. We'll have uh, our choices of what we can run, you know, and use. And um, I know there's a lot of um, other companies out there. Raw Speed makes some tires. A ton of other companies, you know, have the drag tires. These are just what I was able to get my hands on. Uh, and I had these, these came in, they were out of stock for a long time, but they finally came in, so I grabbed them. And then these also, I just finally grabbed those. Um, you could see they are a lot smaller, you know. The, um, the Reaction and that guy, the Hoosiers, they're about the same, but the DE Racing, that's a little guy right there. Uh, and it does look good on the car. You know, I mounted it on there and it did look really good on there. But, yep, so there it is, you guys. There's the weight on them, the three different tires. And, um, yeah, so we're definitely going to get this thing out there and get ripping on it. I just wanted to have a good set of tires to go and do that with. So thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. And I will see you in the next video. Peace.